season's greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we're we're in May. <laughs> it's still a season. We could still greet it. Anyway, this, this game may finish in July. <laughs> yes, actually. So. <laughs> I did a few. I did a little bit of a early morning grinding today. So um, I want to show off what I got done real fast. Yeah, I, I I was like when I was waking up, I'm like, okay, I hear Agrabah music. <laughs> yeah, that was me uh, getting some grinding done. I leveled up sore enough to get once more. I also managed to get finishing plus. This allows me to unleash multiple finishing moves after my combinations. Too bad for me, I'm still a few AP short of the ability. Also, I managed to max out the um, Valor, max out all the current forms for the time being, and I mastered the summon ability as well, so that's taken care of. Also, I got sort of his other um, air combo plus, as well as his other combo plus. He would, no, he already had that from um, the Valor form leveling up. He also managed, I also managed to get the Lucky Lucky from the limit, leveling up the limit form. Huzzah for that. Thank God, that beats the shout out getting up to level 71. Whopping to get it. 5 AP, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's what it is. Also, um, I customized a new ring for Donald. That gives him 7 AP, the Master's Ring. I figure I'll sacrifice a little bit of magic power for that, since Donald tends to fucking piss me off and use his magic incorrectly anyway. <laughs> Other than that, I also managed to grind up a whole bunch of new um, items for say, but I managed to get like a whole bunch of new synthesis materials. I also got Goofy's Nobody Guard from winning it off of the uh, Gambler from one of his mini games. Nice. I also took care of the point requirement for the Cerberus Cup as well. If, uh, ladies and gentlemen, you, well, first off, the m early morning grinding, the fact that uh, myself and Matt sound a little woozy. <laughs> We're recording this the day after Drunk Mario Party. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Matt is in a better state of mind than I am. Oh, far better. I was up at 6 in the morning. Yeah, yeah, grinding Game Wars 2. <laughs> I, on the other hand, slept for a very, very long time. Well, oh, you yeah. thought you died. Yeah, I, I temporarily died. Had an out of body experience. With and, almost 200 likes on Twitter. And, you know, that, <laughs> that, 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 that spirit also had a cup of coffee. <laughs> I wish I had a cup of coffee. I should have gotten me some. Oh, well. I'll, while, while I mourn my lack of coffee, we are going back to Pride Lands for the second story. Like that, well, that 200 why? likes on Twitter. That's a damn shame. Like, <laughs> now, personally, it should be at least two hundred one. <laughs> now, um, quite personally, I love this story. I kind of like the story from the emotional angle here. The second trip is better than the first trip. Yeah. Even though I still don't like Pride Land as a world, at least the boss fight takes advantage of it. Yeah, but this story here is actually pretty fun too. Man, Basically, this place still looks like shit. Oh, well, yeah. Scar's dead, but not forgotten. Scar is dead, but Simba's Scar is dead, and Simba is now the king. So we think. Wow. Hiya. Kiss my ass. Hiya. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to you, clown, we're back to scavenging scraps. Sora, that is not the face of a fighter. <laughs> he's like, oh, I'm ready to fuck you up. And Sora's like, oh, I'm ready he's to pounce. Looking, he's looking forward to it. Does this look like the face of Mercy? <laughs> hey, how's Simba? <laughs> Which one was Whoopi Goldberg again? Her. Shanzi. Yeah, Shanzi. Was, well, it's not Whoopi Goldberg in the game. Yeah, I know. But. Dang Whoopi Goldberg impersonation. I feel like we should get to the Lion King game. Yeah, who's playing it? You? Like, you know how far I got in that game? The level two. Level, yeah, that's where everybody fucks up. Because fuck level two. <laughs> I didn't manage to beat Aladdin for the Genesis, I think. Aladdin's considerably easier, though. Yeah. Have you played the Lion and King? Fun. I have not played it. Yes, <laughs> indeed. I have not played uh, Lion King, though. I have it on the Genesis. You will play it one day. And this is kind of the problem that's facing here. Simba's heart and mind are not meeting. Simba wants to be king, but Simba's not sure how to go about it. Responsibility? This must be that directed DVD movie. <laughs> I don't want an adult. I don't want <laughs> New gimmick. Scar's ghost will be here, here as well. We'll show him off whenever he likes to rear his ugly head. Scar's oh, here he goes. If you recall, the final thing that happened in the first visit was that Scar... Died. Died. And essentially became a heartless. Sort of. No, he became a heartless, but um, now his lingering spirit's kicking around. Yeah. I was surprised we fight Scar's nobody. Well, the thing is, like, usually when I think of a heartless, I think of, you know, entirely black body with beady eyes. True, but there was also Clayton from the first game, too. But he was on the transition, though. And did he become I, a heartless? I, no, he didn't. It, it wasn't explicitly implied that he became a heartless, but at the same time, judging by all his notions, his lack of empathy and all that, he kind of a, he was kind of there. Yeah, but Clayton was also a dick in the movie, though. Clayton yeah. was a dick in the movie, but he was a haughty and proud dick. That Clayton in the Kingdom well, Hearts 1 well, was yeah, just yeah, Clayton. He, but yeah, he was British. But he'll also gun your ass down if it meant not getting the gorilla. 
<laughs> hey, he needs that action. Gorilla. 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 <laughs> yep. You know, you know what? Watching Tarzan is still, still great to watch. I like I like Tarzan. I said it before in that game. Um, I said it before in that game. I like Deep Jungle for the world, its artwork, and everything about it. Just not the missions. Yeah. And this is the problem. Simba's trying to think of how to m maintain the lands in the after his father. And let's be honest, it's kind of like going from Obama to Trump. So, <laughs> Great way to put it. It's great. You got a new house. Now the real estate taxes show <laughs> up. Now the taxes. Yeah. You own a house. Now it got firebombed. Yeah. <laughs> taxes, bills, mortgage. Responsibility back. sucks. That's not Matthew Broderick. <laughs> you don't look so good. Thanks, Goofy. Hey, Simba. Why don't we team up and do something about that scar ghost? The scar Seems poltergeist. Like everybody's worried <laughs> about it. So now's your big chance to show scar. what you're really made of. That doesn't concern you. An extra scar. Shit, you always do that always comes out better. Extra scar. Extra scar. scar. It's okay. Oh now you got balls to fight up against a cub? Fuck you. <laughs> Maybe you just temporarily envisioned him as scar. Here, <laughs> or wait, what was the name of the uh, you, the kid? Man. Kovu? To Kovu, the there you go, yeah. Is what you're gonna do I killed Mufasa, Jojo. The, <laughs> thing, is, though, is, <laughs> the <laughs> thing is, though, is that it's Goofy kind of meant to say what... kind of Goofy kind of worded it wrong because that just put more pressure on him. You know your dad was a I mean, Goofy goofed. <laughs> goofy goofed. Goofy done goofed. Remember what I taught you. You gotta put the past behind you. Believe it or not, the movie was not... The movie was to show that while Hakuna Matata is a helpful philosophy, it's not one... not quite truly the ideal way because even though you put the... Put the best behind you. In their case, it was just throw everything away, which was Simba kind of misconstrued. Today and find my own path. Hakuna Matata. It means Not fuck everything. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. I'm glad to hear you say that. Fuck everything. Hakuna Matata. Fuck school. Fuck your friends, except for those who. Promise me you'll help Simba any way you can. Why do you think we're here? Oh, thanks, dude. Yeah, no problem. I'll uh, no, risk my no life. Simba. And so is our baby. Oh yeah. That starts the second movie. Oh, yeah. You think if we were to go back to Pride Lands, it's going to follow the second film? Great. Now we're I can see the potential for it. <laughs> I actually like the second one. Like I said, I can see the potential like, for it. it. To me, it was one of the better direct to DVD first. sequels. I'm sure well, in this case, direct to VHS. Direct to, well, that was also around Disney DVD starting up for the first time. I don't think it was. I'm pretty sure it was. Now I gained the running tackle ability. And also, I get to change around my party since Goofy is lucky. Lucky Donald warms the bench again. What do you think? What do you think warming the bench is? Sitting in the gummy ship. <laughs> he gets to fly over us. <laughs> He's like a vulture. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> He's just picking scraps. Yeah, circling around Sora's dead body <laughs> because you didn't use cure enough times. You son of a bitch. Oh shit! I forgot to equip my Magniga. Oh, is this the? Um, oh no, I'm thinking after it. No, you're work. right. Yeah. Oh, no, yeah, yeah. All right, ladies, ladies and gentlemen, right here. In the original game, anyway. Yeah. Well, it's not yet because there's only one here. In the original Kingdom Hearts 2, this area was swarming with yeah. those type of Heartless. It was the best place to grind in the entire game. Yep. Magniga and um, Thundaga would easily take them out in bloody swaths, doubly so if you used the Gullwing and the experience boost cap capabilities. Absolutely. By the by, I could have actually gotten the Gullwing much earlier. I just completely forgot all about it. <laughs> I was wondering what, if you had it in your inventory already. No, I don't. You, you can immediately go back to Hollow Bastion after the cutscene there and talk to Eureka, but uh, I forgot. Magniga, though. Oh, yeah, it's, it's the magnet spell. Yeah. I know, I know, but like... The king. He is the need to be king. Dream Drop Distance I has so. Balloon. Equals True. no. And Balloon busted uh, the shit out of fucking Julius. The king. ghost is Scar. Thank you. The evil heart of Scar Dude, meets the hesitating one of Simba. Hesitating. I.E. Simba thinks he wants to be king, uh, but his heart ain't matching. Spirits know you're acting like a punk bitch, Simba. <laughs> <laughs> Take responsibility. You're king. See, in the first film, he just became king right away. Now, what would your father, Darth Vader, would think? You may not know what it is, <laughs> but it still is. Oi, that's mental illness in a nutshell. You know something's fucking up your head, but you, can't, you don't know what the fuck it is, but you know it is. Time for the psych visit. I wonder if they have psychiatrists in the Pride Lands. Yeah, Rafiki. <laughs> yeah, it's like, what do you think Rafiki it's is? It's Rafiki in a white coat. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Rafiki, I don't know what to do. I contemplate life every single day. I feel like I'm not worthy enough to live here. I feel like I should just move on and leave. No. 
Have you ever thought about staying here? <laughs> How about no? There's nothing here, Rafiki. Nothing here. I think it was actually a point in the movie where, um... I didn't even bring it up. By the way, Scar's ghost will haunt, will persist you. Check yeah. this Check this out. God damn! <laughs> if you try to dash, he chases right after you. He's fast as shit. And the Kimbo's over there. That's Simba. Uh, I, I'm Kimbo. <laughs> yeah. My name's not Sora. It's Pora. There aren't any hyenas over there. I know that just by looking at it. Yeah, I can smell the whoopee. <laughs> the whoopee cushion? <laughs> no, the whoopee. No, As if, in the if, if Whoopi Goldberg had a cushion, it'd be Whoopi's cushion. <laughs> yeah. I keep... I, now I'm, I'm like thinking of this one vine I saw. It's um, it's a Lion King vine. Yeah. Where when Rafiki's lifting, um, raising Simba, he just ends up throwing him. Yeah, I love and, that. And he's just like, yay! <laughs> now for those of you who are wondering why I have Jackpot equipped, I like Jackpot. <laughs> no, I can't I mean, try to have this quick. Uh, shut up. <laughs> yeah, I'm equipping the wishing lamp. Why do you have it here? Uh, go, uh, go fuck yourself. Kiss my ass. <laughs> exactly. I disequipped drive converter for now since I'm not going to need it. I'm not going to be really using it for a while. Oh, yeah, I got to go to the elephant graveyard. I forgot about the, uh, dead bones. There it is. Yep. Okay, that shield looks like he has a spiffy little top hat for his little tortoise shell there. <laughs> Oh, good that you slow. No, actually, it looks like a tinfoil hat. Confuse <laughs> like, a conspiracy theorist. Aliens. <laughs> Heartless. <laughs> <laughs> Nobodies. Nobodies. <laughs> oh, I remember this. You have to chase him down. Yeah, but it's not that hard. Do you three know anything about Scar's ghost? It's Scar's ghost. He's dead. <laughs> it's a ghost from a dead lion. Do you know what happened to my original voice actor? It's dead. <laughs> Scar ghost. <laughs> 13 struggle. I no, think this, this is like Roddy Rumble. Rumble. I think this oh, is the yeah. last time we hear Roddy Rumble. I think there's a. Um. Uh, yeah, you're right. Magic works too. Fuck yeah! <laughs> In fact, that's, you, that's how you should be doing this. God damn. Yeah, it stops them right in their tracks. Where's WWF when you need them? They cast Thunder Magic in wrestling. <laughs> the Wildlife Fund. Oh, the Wild. Yeah, the Wildlife Fund. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Every time I think about that, I always think of the mock-up image where it was two panda bears sitting each other with steel chairs. <laughs> right. I know. <laughs> There's <laughs> Bonzi. Bonzi? That's, yeah, Shenzi, Bonzi, and Ed. Ed's the crazy one, right? Ed's the, Ed is the American, yeah. Ed's the crazy one because, yeah, his name's Ed. <laughs> <laughs> He's the American. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, fuck him up. You fucking idiot. Go back to school. <laughs> make, make him laugh in his grave. I'll die laughing. I'll die laughing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, what happened? I laughed my ass off. <laughs> That's two. There's Ed. Now Shanzi. Shanzi always gave me trouble. Shanzi likes to hide in the middle. Where is Shanzi? She's where you need her to be the most. In my heart. I uh, think he's. I, I think he passed her. No, that was a. I'm. I. I, I, I respect Whoopi, but I want her, nothing to do with her. <laughs> Whoopi. You can do it. Come on. Oh. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> That's why you use magic. Nice. I gain another accessory slot. Goofy gets MP reach. And Donald and Simba get a bonus to their HP. Nice. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Here that Donald and I could suck a little less. Yeah. <laughs> Guess you caught us all. Beat the shit out of us, too. Yeah, yeah dude. <laughs> Yeah, dude, I mean, damn, what's wrong with Tag? About Scar's ghost. Sorry. Are we, were we not we playing Thunder not Tag? <laughs> oh, wait. We yeah, don't know that nothing. That's the one that only hangs out around Freddy. Yeah, what if Sora was like the Drive grammar Nazi? <laughs> <laughs> we don't know nothing. We don't know nothing. We don't know anything. Yeah. God. <laughs> Hawaiian Creole English, jackass. <laughs> Simba. Simba, do something. Come on, Simba. Simba, you can go away. <laughs> shh, shh. As us Simba is enraptured in a game of Fable 3. <laughs> he just spits on him. After all, you are the son of the great Mufasa. <laughs> and they're just, just eyeing right they're, <laughs> they're just eyeing dead ass. Yeah. <laughs> Technically, Shanzi was a girl. Simba. Yeah, but what about Bonzi and Ed? 
But the Monzi and Ed Kara, Simba's ass ain't going in their faces. Rafiki was right. You mean Simba's still unsure? Seems like. Could you uh, look a little so more distressed there, Sora? <laughs> <laughs> can, you, can you Sora? Stop? Can you change your face? When when friends are down, you can't have a happy face. You gotta have a frowny face. I know the face. boast runs on happy faces, but only at the appropriate times. <laughs> <laughs> We're nearly turned into late. <laughs> This music is so triumphant. It is. You wouldn't know piece of based shit. off Simba's <laughs> uh, situation at the moment. Look at that blue ass. Isn't he supposed to be a red ass baboon or something? No, he's special. He's a Disney, he's a Disney baboon. Oh. So apparently red means it gets censored, so it's blue. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's the Mr. Popo situation. Fucking four kids. <laughs> <laughs> The only thing to think of is what to do. Not what others think of him. The library? And Nala's censoring his ass. Oh, I get it. Simba now has to disable those YouTube comments. <laughs> <laughs> so he has to stop thinking about what other people think about him. I'll lead the way. Yeah, right. Okay, that was nice. You know, make fun of your friend's body odor. Hang on. So, Goofy now has MP Rage, which is helpful for him to a degree, depending on how much of an ass beating he takes. But, uh, AP's a little tight, so no. But the day of MP Gift is gone. <sighs> we need, we never had that moment of silence for that ability, did we? Never. Maybe early on the playthrough, but if not, let's do it now. Do, 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 I'm bored now. Do, 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 anyway. Do. Are you going to put in, like, a eulogy for that thing, Elliot? Like what? <laughs> Just like, you know, having like a little eulogy for how awesome that ability was before we lost it. What am I going to equip in its place? Mm. Fuck it. Okay. You still, have three, you still have three more AP left for him, too. And I got ri and I just spent that on MP Rage. Well, that's significantly better, in my opinion. MP Rage? Yeah. I don't know how much of an ass beating you're willing to take. It's goofy. Oh, no, I'm talking about Sora. Oh. Yeah, it's goofy. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Do you even get experience for beating Scar's Ghost? You get satisfaction, and god damn it, sometimes that makes it better. Because uh, Bustin' makes you feel good. What is this? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I really do like those Heartless. The Neo Shadows? The Neo Shadows? Yeah, they look really cool. Burn, baby. Remember seeing those in the... The end trailer for I did too, and yeah. I was thinking they'd be so much more. And it's like, oh, you're really just nothing. Well, there's the thing. I mean, they're more threatening in Chain of Memories because they broke your fucking cards all the time with the goddamn eats. You see them for the first time ever in the trailer leading up to Kingdom Hearts 2 at the end of Kingdom Hearts 1 when he did everything you could possibly do. And then that was around the first time I heard of Final Mix, yeah, which I only saw screenshots of in an email that. I and then they came out to play there too as the um. They also, uh, what should I call it? They are fightable in uh, Kingdom Hearts One, but they got a yeah. much more interesting gimmick. In a, in a sense of that, and being a pain in the ass. You also don't fight them everywhere. I think it's only in the end of the world. The end of the world, one room only. Yeah. And they attack you on Moss in that one. Of course, but you know, and they're also one of the few ways to get the rare item you need for a couple of rare items. It's fun. As, uh, Dragon rush. rights though at that point, because the unknown fight is really not that hard. It's not. You're absolutely right. What the fuck am I doing? Zap. <laughs> Shaman are back as well as oh yeah I remember these fuckers. Why are they here? Poachers? God, damn it. Poachers, yeah. When Beast Castle left his door open. <laughs> they just go everywhere. They left the gate open. Awesome. The gate to other worlds. So we had to find Simba. Yeah. I also have to kill these things because they're in my way. Ow. But that one, so this up, they're in my way. <laughs> That's Donald. Got in my way. Trust me, if we leave these Neo Shadows alone for too long, they're going to do the human slingshot, which is a one-hit kill. I wouldn't be surprised if that was actually a thing they would do. Oh, that'd be hilarious. It's just, like, was it? One, two. You need four Neo Shadows to do it. <laughs> like the Neo Shadows are doing the human slingshot? Yeah. yeah. You got the two Neo Shadows on the left and right to set up the slingshot. You have the third Neo Shadow that pulls the fourth Neo Shadow back, and you let him go. One-hit kill. <laughs> Good for them, bad for Sora. I don't know why, but that sounds really badass. It is a hidden ability in Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker. Yeah. 
one hit kills see, everything. See, when you put it in Metal Gear Solid, when you put it in Metal Gear Solid, it, it sounds ridiculous. Oh, but it's <laughs> hilarious, though. You get a four-player multiplayer match going on. Everyone has that ability to unlock. You aim Snake right at the hind gate. <laughs> it takes it down. It, yeah, it's a one-hit kill. On it takes, everything? It takes forever to unlock, but it's a one-hit kill. It's a one-hit kill on everything. Yeah. Jesus Christ. You know what I really kind of miss from these things? These nuts. Uh, I got him. What is it? <laughs> Basically, um, they used to have like a drop rate where you could get elixirs from them modestly comfortably. This way, you wouldn't have to waste time synthesis yeah. with synthesis. But um, their drop rate might have been restored proper now, so it's actually a little more of a pain in the ass to get them. Yeah. Restored proper, proper lucky, or lucky. neutered? Oh, maybe neutered. Because like yeah. I said, I think the drop rate may have been changed to what it should have been. You but said like full out elixirs, right? Yeah. But that's probably why. I mean, elixirs restore everything. And if you got them at a modestly comfortable rate, then they probably thought it's kind of break the game. Yeah. Synthesis or not, they're still elixirs. Right. Which made Can we not talk about synthesis in Final Mix? Yeah, if they. Like, it sucks like what was it like it in is, Final Mix? It sucks dick. Kingdom Hearts 1 Final Mix synthesis is a f incredibly fucking obnoxious. Doubly but, so because, you know, now it's a real pain in the ass to get an ultimate weapon. Yeah. My ultimate weapon kind of became Lionheart. I mean, yeah, the Lionheart afterwards. Like, like, like what was it like? You just, there was more to do. Yeah, basically, the thing is, though, is that you had to do, like, mini Heartless with some mini games. Yeah. And some of the Heartless had the very rare items you needed to get multiple, multiple times. Yeah. The Black Serenade thing is interesting the first time you got to do it. Six or more is fucking annoying. Yeah. So it's like adding an extra step. Uh, adding three extra steps. Adding three extra steps and two different manuals. Yeah. <laughs> two different manuals. In two different languages. Exactly. None of them English. Yeah. <laughs> does anybody know how to it's speak Czechoslovakian? Does anyone know how to speak Swahili? <laughs> Conquesto? Uh, that's... Uh, shut up. <laughs> who, knows how, who knows how to speak Deutsch? Yeah. <laughs> I'm a ton of your Hakuna. You mean your Hakuna, your, ta your Matata? Father. No, just, just this guy. This is CNN. Mm -hmm. Try again. It seems even your daddy has abandoned you. How well, he's dead. Yeah. Yeah, that's dead. Where, where's, where's Mufasa's ghost? And yeah, taking no. his place in the great circle of life. Oh, bullshit. <laughs> he's eating Cheetos while watching his soap <laughs> <up> this. <laughs>